What's going on YouTube? Damn, I like I really missed y'all. Like I really, really, really missed y'all. Sorry for my disappearance, man. You girl been sick, and this work is just ah. So, but I'm glad to be back and to you know see you guys in beautiful faces. Yeah. Um. But yeah. So today I have a wig review, and of course. The first wig that I'm going to be talking about is the Free Trust Equal Freedom Part Wig. So it is this right here. And I'm pretty sure you guys probably seen videos of this as well. But when I first saw it, I was like, okay, well, this look cute. I want to, you know, try it. Um, so I went to my local beauty supply store and I was looking all over for um this wig because when i saw it i'm like okay well it looks real cute so you know what i want to try it but i want it with some color so the color i got was the ot 530 so it's like an ombre with the 530 is like a wine color so i went to be so i bought it i think this thing was probably like yeah there you go 34.99 you yeah, can see that 34 goddamn 49 uh, 30, uh, 99 sorry but of course when I went on Sam's Beauty it was much cheaper but me when it comes to like wigs I really have to like see it first to get an idea of how it look if it's not too shiny or whatnot before I say I want to buy it so what I'm gonna do is um try it on so I can show you guys like what I feel about the wig and stuff so let's see the package it looks like more so this is the color it's a very um nice wine cherry red color like it's not bright at all like it's just that perfect color like if you wanted to color your bundles this this is that red right here um the waves i really like the waves have that soft wave which i really like um it's so pretty and of course this is the part you know this is how it look like it showed in the um on the, on the uh, diagram there. It has two combs in the front, one comb in the back. I don't really use the whole combs. Eh. And it has like a adjustable strap in the back to kind of, um, if you want to make it tight or anything. So, let me put that on. Let's put that on this thing. I have my hair braided down. It's not too fancy, just some cornrows. So, this is what the wig looked like on my head. Um, I'm really in love with the color, I must say that. Like, the color is gorgeous. And I'm using my ring light, so this is, you know, what it looks like. But, like, the color is really gorgeous. Like, it complements with my skin tone. That's what I really love. Because sometimes you just got to be careful with the kind of reds you're going with, especially of us, you know, melon girls you know but um i really like really love the color the part i, I don't know like i'm <clears throat> i just wish it was a little bit wider um i did try to pluck it and stuff like that but um i just wish it was a tad bit more lighter i just feel like the closure or the the, the part area is a bit on the flat side like, it's just not giving me that zhuzh that I want. But the waves are, like, beautiful. Oh, my God. Let me give a 360. Like, that. Got a little shit going on. That is, like, literally. This color is gorgeous. Like, really gorgeous. I feel like even if I wanted to part it. I mean, even if I wanted to um, pluck it, I feel like there's not enough space. The idea that you would think buying this wig because it says a freedom part, initially when you have lace closures, you know, you're able to like, you know, if you want to put it to the side or anything like that. But really, the reason why they call it a freedom part is necessarily just talking about the wig, not the closure. In the sense that you could wear it to the middle or to the left or to the right. So being that this is in the middle, it's on the flat side, so I'm not really feeling that too much. So let's let me take this off and try to shift it to the left, cause the left is my part. So I 
All right, so this is to the left and guys tell me what you think i mean i feel like for the left it's probably not that bad maybe because i switched it to the left only thing is um the level variation it's almost like as if you got an asymmetrical type of bob where one side is longer and the other side it's a shorter which i don't really care for like i it's different why not the color is still gorgeous like come on you guys like oh my god look look at the color lord like the color is very pretty like so 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 pretty i wonder if i can brush it if it just kind of give it make it bigger or something like i think what's really killing me is the um it's the part like the part is it's right here it's just flat like that it's just right there like i wonder how the let's see how the right look i'm not really a right person but eh. um let's see Mm. Oh no, it's a no for me. It's a no for me for the right. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, I think maybe the left is just gonna be the for the winner, like at this point. <laughs> Cause I, um, I'm not, no. Ooh, okay, okay. But yeah, I, I thought it would have done something, but as apparently no, like this is what it is for the most part. Um, is it on a big head friendly side? Yeah, it is. Uh, I think with adjustable straps, it gives it that um, the the ability to like tighten it up as much as you want or loosen it up to your like ability. Um, for the price that it was at the B supply, it could have really been like twenty five dollars at least. I don't think it was worth thirty. Being to the fact that it's not even a Freedom Park cloak, like a free part closure, it's more of a Freedom Park wig. And I feel like um, a lot of women. I think I saw a lot of videos too where women complain about the part, and I agree that the part is really not so appealing. It's very just straight. Oh, I hurt myself. It's just very straight. It doesn't have no kind. It just, it doesn't make it look realistic in the sense. It, it's almost like there's no point of you trying to even customize it because there really is no part in space. Like, this is just it. Like, literally right there. So, you're really not plucking anything. So, I think it's such a bummer that I expect free chest. I mean, and plus free chest has other wigs with the closures. So, I'm kind of disappointed with them in this wig, particularly because of the 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 closure but the color is to die for like the color is gorgeous who knows maybe i might wear to work yeah but um yeah you guys um is it worth to buy this no not necessarily because of just the construction of it um but it, it does fit snug i feel like once you use adjustable straps um, with the combs it's up to you i don't really do the whole comb because i don't like it like all into my, my scalp like that but um this is a beautiful wig but i'm just not happy with the um the closure but you guys let me know what your thoughts is um how if you like this wig um other than that this is basically my first impressions and what i thought about the hair um for my new subscribers hey guys how y'all doing thank you for subscribing to my channel welcome 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 and for those who've been following y'all already know what the love is like but yeah you guys thank you so much for watching and hope you guys have a wonderful day love y'all